Welcome back to Zephyr Field, where New Orleans leads the Iowa Cubs 1-0 in the top of the fourth. Now, we already have a crowd favorite here. He may be pretty familiar to some of you LSU fans. Austin Nola, he's gotten on base tonight, leadoff single and an error. He walked out to the Tiger fight song. He is from Baton Rouge, and he has about 40 friends and family here to cheer him on. Now, they will be selling the Nola on the front, Nola on the back shirts for the series next weekend, so you definitely want to catch those. And his little brother, Aaron Nola, was a stud pitcher at LSU. He also just got called up to Triple. Thank you, Tim. Now, I'm sure you guys have been seeing these hats all over the park. The players are wearing them. You're going to see it all over minor league and major league baseball. It's a July 4th Stars and Stripes hat. They are the most popular hats of the year, and fans, you can buy them up in the team store, but they're going to probably sell out tonight. So if you want the same hat that the pros are wearing, you go get it right now. Guys, I'll send it back to you. Kelsey Winger. Thanks, Tim. Now, I know you guys just saw that single from Juan Diaz. This is actually his fourth consecutive game with two hits today. He's three for four with two doubles and a single. He's had 13 multi-hit games this season, and they've all actually came in the last 17. Now, in those last 17 games, he's batting well over 300, and coming in today, he had six doubles, three home runs, and 11 RBIs. So he's going to be a pretty big piece in the success going forward this season if he can stay this high. Swing's fouled off. Thanks to Kelsey, and uh, he's down on the field with Kelsey Winger. Yeah, thanks, Tim. Like you said, I'm down here with Austin. Austin, what a night. Four for five, two RBIs. You reached on all five at-bats. Were you just seeing it really well tonight? Yeah, I mean, it's one of those games all baseball players go through. See the ball, and it hits your sweet spot every time, and I was fortunate to have that. And just how special was this night for you? It is your New Orleans debut. You're from Baton Rouge. You have over 40 friends and family here cheering you on. So how much did that mean to you to perform like that? Excellent. I mean, I love having my family here. They don't get to come to many. I've been playing far away from home, and it was the first time I got to come back to Louisiana during my professional career, so it was a blessing, and I love it. Hopefully, we can continue to do it. And how much confidence does a game like this give you going forward, especially when you're pretty new to AAA? A lot of confidence. I mean, you just play the game. That's how it goes in this game. I mean, you play double A, high A, and all that, and it just the experiences you have help you as you move on, and that's what I'm just continuing to do. And y'all only didn't look well. I almost got hit with the ball there. You only didn't look well offensively. You had multiple guys performing offensively. Your pitcher throws a complete game shutout. So what's the mindset of the team going into tomorrow's game? It helps when you have a lot of guys swinging it. I mean, when you're ahead in the game, you're able to go ahead and take pitches that you want to swing at. When you're down in the game, you have to take pitches. You have to work the count. So right here, it worked out perfectly. We got ahead. A lot of guys had a couple hits, so I was able to capitalize. Well, what a game. Like I told you earlier, I still can't believe it. I'm so happy for you that you get to celebrate with your friends and family. Guys, I'll send it back up to you.